Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We're jumping in again. I think I'm going to go for a challenge this time. I'm not quite sure which one. Let's take a little look. I want to do one that's like relatively hard but has a decent reward. Um, so I'm not quite sure what's the best for that. Uh, Scatman isn't hard but that's good. Ooh, Bloody Mary is a good I idea. Let's try and do Bloody Mary, because um, it's tough, and Sigil of Baphomet is, like, the best trinket in the game. Or one of the best. <clears throat> By the way, I apologise if I keep clearing my throat. I've just had my lunch, and um, I had, like, kind of a greasy burger, sort of. <clears throat> I, like, I had some mincing, and I made a burger, but I didn't have any burger buns, so I used a wrap. So it was, it was kind of a burger, but not really. Um, kind of a weird one. Um, we can go in here, right? <clears throat> Ooh, two black runes. Damn it, did not mean to get hit there. What we got here? We got the Hanged Man, and we got Tower. Um, this is kind of tricky. I've got a lot of things in here that I like. Um, <clears throat> hmm. I think... I think I'm going to take the Hanged Man out and maybe come back for the other stuff. Because I want a black rune. A black rune could be real damn good. Do we get item rooms in this challenge? I think we do. Okay. Careful with this. Try and get as much money as I can out of this. Does, it, does the money disappear? I think it does, doesn't it? Oh no, it doesn't. Okay. Nice. If I can get up to 15, I'd be really happy. So let's try and do that. Really? That was such a stupid bit of damage there. Okay, nice, nice, nice. We got up to 15. Keep this going just in case we've still got it for a little while. We do. I don't know how much longer we have it for. It was 60 seconds it said, wasn't it? Yeah, we lost it. Okay. <clears throat> Honestly, that was pretty good. We got a luck penny out of it. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Right. Um. Unfortunately, an abysmal shop there. But we've got money for the next shop we come across. And I'm willing to take a gamble here, come in here now, and um, grab a black rune. I'd like to take both, but unfortunately, we cannot. But yeah, black rune, potentially very, very useful. <clears throat> so I will take it. If we get like a bad boss item, we could get some better stats out of it sort of thing. You guys are going to lob your heads at me in a minute. <clears throat> and I'm not ready for that at all. Luckily, these guys aren't able to hit the fires, so they're not that big of a threat. They're just lobbing ash... Here and there. Anyways, as for the question of the day today, what's your preferred weather? Like, and I, I don't mean as in like time of year, do you like summer or winter? What is like, your actual preferred weather? If it's going to be any weather, what would, what would you prefer it to be? Because at the minute, I'm really enjoying the sun. But I'll be honest, I'm not like a big fan of it being really hot. Like, I, I, I don't completely hate it, but I'd much rather it be... Um... Oh, we can use this twice, you know, let's use this twice because this guy's an absolute nightmare. Um... <clears throat> I'd much rather it be just, like, warm enough to be able to, like, go out and not have to wear a jacket or a jumper, but not be so hot that I'm boiling. What are you going to do now? Oh, that fucking attack is ridiculous, and you know it, you absolute pube. You absolute pube is what you are. <clears throat> um, I think I'll take that. I don't think I want to black rune that. Golden pickup was unfortunately not the sort of thing we were looking for, but I'll take it. Um, okay, let's go down to the next floor. Okay, black rune still in tow. We do not get item rooms on this challenge. That's definitely one of the things that makes it quite hard. Of course, we do take damage here as well. Definitely the hardest part about it is not having health for the majority of floors. We can get any way to bring health to the next floor. We, we want to do that. We do have Curse of Misfortune here, which I, just, I should probably go and check what that does. Because <clears throat> I have no idea what that does right now. Curse of Misfortune. Have a little look-see. Curse of Misfortune. Where are you? Minus five luck. Oh, lovely. So I got all that extra luck there, and it's not been valuable to me really at all. Very good trinket, although Child's Heart is pretty good too. What does the trinket do again? Um, chance to give a fire tier the Godhead Aura. I think I'd rather take that, to be honest. It's going to be pretty good. Um, 
Hmm. I think I'll take that. Golden key. Not great right now, but good in general. Can we buy a heart in here? Sadly not. <clears throat> I don't know what the chances are to fire a Godhead or it used to say it had a 16% chance, but it doesn't say that anymore. Oh god. Just realised there's red fires in this room. Do not want to deal with them shooting at me very much, thank you. I'm going to try and actually clear the room without dealing with them, which is risky. Ooh, that's really good, that. Let's take out this fire. Morbid heart, thank you. That actually helps a ton. Really like having that bad boy on board. Let's keep it moving. Keep it moving and grooving. But yeah, Godhead tier. I think Child's Heart potentially is better for this challenge, but the Godhead aura tiers every now and again, especially if we get fire rate increases, can be really damn good. Oh god, this room is tragic. Right, try and get some HP out of these. Quickly check this out. <clears throat> Uh, nah, I don't think there's anything I can really garner from those. I'm not really that bothered. Right, keep it moving. But yeah, this challenge, definitely one of the ones in Repentance that took me a good while. Definitely one of those Repentance challenges that is not so easy. But I like it, though. I think it's a cool challenge. I, think it, I like challenges that are actually challenging, and this is certainly one of them. Okay. I'm going to take you out. The good thing is the Godhead Aura... Even if it's just a single enemy, we're getting extra damage out of it. So it's a small chance to fire tiers that do a good bit of extra damage. And then, of course, in regular rooms, have that extra bit of AoE as well, which is really nice. I'm pretty sure Grey, Grey Monster is just he can't do the large jump, but everything else is the same. I think he has slightly more HP as well. Which is why he is a big boy. Okay, there you go. Nice. We got Golden Safety Pin, which... I don't know. I think I'll take it. I think I'll take Golden Safety Pin. It's not amazing, but five range and a good amount of shot speed, it's not terrible. And I think Black Runing that could give us less stats overall. Also, the Black Hearts aren't bad for the extra charges. I was just about to say, what happens with our Morbid Heart here? We do actually get to keep the Morbid Heart, which is nice. So bad. Also, yeah, the shot speed and range allows us to keep our distance while we have low HP, which I quite like. And that's going to be pretty darn useful overall. This is a terrible, terrible, terrible room. The bubbles can be really, really bad. Um, don't want to bother with that. <clears throat> God damn. It's always scary each time you start a new floor. Got to hope for that HP to drop. See if Child's Heart does you a solid. But we do not have Child's Heart, so it will be doing us zero solids. Dude, this guy is in such an awful position to kill him. And I'm pretty sure he's the champion that splits off shots when he dies as well. Yes, he is. <clears throat> a full Morbid Heart. Really, really good to get a Morbid Heart, to be honest. If we can keep that alive, that'd be, that's going to be so good for us. Soul heart there as well. Good, good, good. Hopefully we can get some more money as well because we have the extra item in our shop. That could potentially be really good. Nice. You're not so bad. You're not so bad. You guys are quite bad though. But yeah, it's, it's quite nice weather at the minute here. Finally, the UK is starting to cheer up a little bit and it's not so depressing as it is eight months out of the year. Um, <clears throat> it means I've been like going out running and stuff. It's been quite nice. It's just nice to sort of be able to go out and be active without worrying about the weather. It's not like the warmest at the minute, but we're having some like 15 degree uh, or higher days up to sort of 2025, which is, yeah, just been lovely. Extra bomb. Good, good, good. Is that a champion? That one worm looks bigger. Oh, God. Okay, yeah, it is a champion. It's just not coloured correctly. Hey, extra HP is lovely. Don't drug me, please. 
Um, I'll come back to the shop. I'm not going to open it with the one key I have while I, um, <clears throat> I'm in a situation where I can't afford anything. It's pretty stupid. Are these the electric guys? Yeah. Yes, they are. I'm actually trying to take out this guy first. The electric guys, we've got to be careful because they do the little lightning thing when they die. It can hit you pretty easily if you're not careful. It's, it, it's generally pretty easy to avoid, but when there's other enemies in the room and you're dealing with that, it can be a little problematic. What we need now is piercing to make our uh, Godhead aura tears even better. Or we could just get Godhead from the Angel deal, but we don't have that unlocked, so maybe not. <laughs> I said that just assuming it's unlocked and obviously remembered. No, it's not. Oh, what the fuck? Fuck you. What the hell? <laughs> I was like, okay, I'll just come kill these guys. No, I just spawned a bunch of these guys that drop in. Bullshit. Hate that. Fuck you. Very upset by that. Lost my Angel deal chance. For no good reason. Also, gotta love a double trouble boss for no reason whatsoever. Really makes me smile. Got a bomb in there. Do not like the prospects of this at all. Luckily, Stain is almost dead. I'm not able to kill him where, he, where he's sat now, though. Oh, no, we got him. We got him. Oh, that was a very good hit by you, good sir. Don't lose the Morbid Heart, whatever we do. Do not lose the Morbid Heart. It's valuable as shit to us. Gives us a lot of safety. This could be bad because it could give us a health down, so I'm just going to go like that. We got damage and speed. Very, very happy with that. Could have given us better stats if we took it, but I could not risk the health down. <laughs> right, through here we go. Oh. Please, please, please. Ah, it didn't gulp it, but still, it's really good anyways. Find other trinkets and gulp the hell out of them. I love this. Amalgamation is one of my favourite trinkets in the entire game. It's just so fucking cool. Right, we did indeed get a heart there as well, so we're sitting pretty in that regard. Um, I think this is worth it. Indeed it was, indeed it was. Up to full HP in that regard too. Good damage for the next floor. Where do we take this fight again? Oh, this is a Satan fight. Oh, God. This run's going to be spicy. One's gonna be spicy. Sack room has nothing for us. Good thing is we don't really have to rush to um, find our item rooms and stuff. We just find our shop and we're good to go. We got good damage now as well, or at least decent damage. Keep it moving and grooving. These guys are a pain. Fair balls. You're also a pain as well, you little goosey goober. There you go, though. Not so bad, not so bad. I'd like one more damage up, I think, from my boss room, and then I'd be happy. Not a big fan of this. Oh, bugger. Okay. Getting at angel deals is going to be nearly impossible. I kind of didn't realise that. This is a horrible, horrible room in general. Yeah, sadly, Angel Deal is going to be very, very hard for us to, to get. We can't get hit really at all. Okay, we found this at least. Unfortunately, we're not getting anything useful in our shops, like, at all, which is really, really upsetting. Like, our shops could be a hell of a lot better, and we, we have the money to enable them as well, and it's just like, no. It just says no to us. Thank you for that. Damn it. Do you know what? I don't even care about this room. Bugger you. I know it's a waste of a bomb, but I ain't doing that. Do you know what? I'll use my book on this room. 
It's nice that it starts you off with this book, actually. I think your damage would be a real problem if it didn't. Oh, fuck you. Lemon-headed fucks. Da die! Oh my god! Getting so frustrated at the moment. Give me that back. Fill up my morbid heart again. Two black hearts. Good for charges. Right, take out these first, thank you. To get all these white spiders out the heckin' way. It's gonna be real annoying otherwise. My god, this guy's moving at some speed. Is this a champion version of him, or is he normally this fast? It seems hella fast. Okay, he's into second phase. The brimstone shall be coming shortly. No explosive tears, though. Okay, we got the easy brimstone. Oh, I say that and immediately get hit. Fuck, I went the wrong way. Okay, we got him. Mum's lipstick. Come on now, don't be like that. Our range is crazy, but yeah. Come on, okay, we need a shop that's actually going to give us some value. Give us a champion belt, please. Dude, no! Oh my god. Fucking hearts, man. That was such an interesting run, potentially, and it has been cut down in its prime. I mean, I'm pretty happy with that. That's a good start. Fuck you. This room's gross. This room's truly gross. We get through it there. Yeah, don't you piss around with your stupid tail. Back off. Big fuck off. Right. Okay, our speed is looking good. Damage is now looking good. Can't get that tinted rock, unfortunately. A hey, more keys is great here, though. I'm liking that. Take out the poops first. Take out the ads in general, because they're going to be really annoying. Okay, now you're gonna spawn a bunch of shit, aren't you? Okay, now you're now you're pretty easy. Just careful of that little bouncy around thing, because we cannot kill that. Okay, dead. Not so bad. You did spawn a beater, but I'll give you that one. Oh, blood clot as well. Okay, this is a this is a pretty good start as well, to be honest. Damage wise, we are looking real good. Um. Don't think we'll be taking that. Ooh. That was valuable. We don't know what our health is, but we know at least we're not on completely in the red. Do not like this situation. Good, good. There's going to be a lot of, like, hard focus for me, I think. I'm going to be really being very, very cautious and careful. My commentary might, uh might be lacking due to that, so I apologise in advance, but it's stressful times, you know? Stressful times. Really? You're gonna drop money over there that I can't get to? I'm gonna waste this bomb right here. Ayo! Okay, this is a good room. This paperclip I remember being really good. Not paperclip, you know what it is. You know what I meant. Good, good, good. 10% chance to double hearts, coins, keys, and um, pickups with choice options no longer disappear. That is pretty darn good. And then this is 10% chance uh, for a heart room clear. Yeah, I think I'd rather have this. Shop, can you be better for us this time? Oh boy, you are indeed better for us this time. Okay. 
So actually now, I think now Child's Heart is better because we already have the ability to double things. A 10% chance to double isn't really that valuable. But there you go. Bumbling Bundle. That could be a saviour. Oh, for God's sake. Du double use this because this guy, again, just a nightmare. Don't you dare do your little throwy explosion-y bullshit that you normally do. So much fire. Fuck you! With your bullshit explosions! Oh my god, I'm gonna miss out my angel deal now. Ugh, that is gross. To the highest degree. Um... I didn't take damage from Blood Oath there. I'm not quite sure why. Was it because I was transitioning through two runes? I do not know, but I did not take damage there. And I'm very confused by that. I hate these enemies. Especially when they've got so much goddamn health. What the hell? Room's really annoying with the sucky thing in the middle. Don't let him puke. There you go, we're good. Double keys, baby. Thank you. Got them back quick and easy. Don't puke, don't puke, don't puke. But that one did puke. Try and keep our angel deal alive this time, if we can. Not saying it's gonna happen, but we can try our best. Turn all these into slot first and then try killing them. Good, good. Try and beeline it straight to the boss if we can. Careful of the rock guy as well. He does a fountain of tears. More keys. Oh, humbling bundle. You absolute beaut. And you didn't spawn any pooters either. Lovely. Oh, yes. Blood clot plus the packs here is real nice. This is our first genuine room where we could take some damage, so let's be careful. Just because of the webbing. Actually, we got it. We got this one in the bag. Wasn't so hard. We even got some spare HP there. Not that we need it. Any of these big rooms I'm going to be uh, using my active in because we get two charges back for them. So unless we're one room off of our boss, it makes sense. Take all of y'all out. Get off of there. Oh, lots of bombs. Wow. Uh, I'll go in here. We've, we've got success out of this last time. Not really sure how to feel about this this time. Dude, that didn't work the way I wanted it to. It's okay, we got a soul out of it there. Okay, not the greatest, but not a loss. Oh, for fuck! Yeah, god damn it! I moved in the wrong way there. I hate myself so, so dearly. Oh my god, I feel like such a goddamn moron for that. Fuck's sake. I can still get an angel deal here. Let's not. Okay, no. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I retract my previous statement. We could not get an angel deal still. We're having to fight against Satan incarnate. Look at that half of the room that's now just completely shut off from us. Because of this disaster. Can, can these tears stop floating? There you go. Took you long enough. Oh my god, I did it. Didn't get an angel deal though. <laughs> Such fun. Oh god, I'm so annoyed. Hate myself so much right now. How'd I get hit there? Bullshit. Ugh, oh, this is an awful room as well. Equally hate this. Good.
Right. No herming, boys. No herming. Um, I don't know what that does, but I feel like it's going to kill me if I use it, so... I'm a little bit put off by it being free. I feel like it would hurt me if I used it. Two golden keys. I, 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 I can't hit him. God damn it. Having such a hard time then. Fuck! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it was such a good run. Oh my god, if I'd have got that angel deal, who knows, I could have got Holy Mantle, it could have all been fixed. Could have all been fixed. No damage up this time to start us off as well, which just feels like a slap in the face, to be honest. Oh, that was a good hit, that was a good hit. Can you calm the fuck down, my guy? I mean, that is pretty darn good for future flaws, I gotta say. You're getting a pickle. Use that card. Oh my god. Very annoyed at myself for losing that last run. I tried my best. Rooms like that. The trap ones just confuse the hell out of me. I can't remember what these guys even do when they blow up, but it'll be fine. If they just spawn a random dude, it's okay by me. It's not even a hard dude either, but a guy that shoots at you. Okay. Take care of all y'all. And actually got an easy boss this time. A joyous day of days. A miracle has been bestowed upon us. We've not got some bullshit. There you go. Not so bad, not so bad. HP up isn't bad either. Down to the next floor. How did we prevent ourselves getting hit before? Was it just like moving into another room while it was doing the thing? There you go. Back up to full on this floor at least. I could try and get that Sinted Rock there, but it's going to be too much of a pain. In fact, maybe... Maybe I can do it. There you go. I managed it. Wasn't super valuable in the end, but I managed it. Okay. Okay. Don't like rooms like this either. Too many white spiders. Okay. I'm so stressed right now, I I'll be honest. I'm so goddamn stressed. This, this challenge is something I didn't think I'd have to re-experience for a long time, but I've bestowed it upon myself. Do you know what? I'm going to play you down to one heart. Get back in there. What's this do? Consumes one red heart, but permanently makes Isaac shoot more tears in a random direction. The tears deal 65%. Okay. I'll 
Ah. Ah. Didn't know it meant that. Still, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for that regardless. It's risky, but I like the idea. Oh, no, that's not what I thought. I thought it meant, like, fire where you're firing, not, like, just a spew around you. I mean, it's, it's decent, but it's not really what I was hoping for. Very, very low range. Maybe my, my range will help it. I don't know. We'll find out. I suppose it is good for enemies to get close range. Still scary, though. Yeah, it's actually, it's actually kind of working out kind of nicely. Getting some kills off of it. I like that. Didn't realize it was going to take a red heart container, though. I just misread that, I think. Oh, you bastard. I thought I could get him before he moved, but sadly not. Trying to stay up close to do as much extra damage as I can, but I don't want to lose my angel deal also. Okay, we got him. Finally got an angel deal. Oh, wait, no. It's a devil deal. Oops, I forgot about that. Doesn't matter. Let's just go. Oh, my god. Kind of forgot the damage bonus we'd get from Blood Earth is a lot less when we have less red hearts, but hey her. Hey oh, saving grace. Aw, oh, you idiot. Use this on a room with enemies that don't even take regular damage. I just hit them multiple times. Okay. Keep it moving along. Oh god, that was close. These chaser boys are not dying. Don't jump at me, little mushroom. Goddamn, so many keys. What the hell's going on with all the keys, baby? These rabies bats are uh, kind of scary as well. Nah, one golden chest. Oh, it's not really worth my time right now. These guys are going to do their own thing as well. Yeah, this scalpel thing really hasn't been as good as I thought it would be. But then again, it was only a quality one item. I couldn't expect it to be amazing. Just thought for giving away your HP, it'd be a little bit better than just a spew of tears randomly around you. Thought it'd be kind of spewed forwards. Not really gotten, gotten enough money this run to do anything with the shop. You all got Spoonbender. Lovely. Although you are permanently confused by the looks of things, so it doesn't really matter what item you got given. Right, take care of these first. Is this the only spawning stuff one? I think it is. Okay, he's got a pooter sat behind him. Multiple pooters sat behind him. Still think that's one of those bullshit things that this boss can do. The fact that it can have... Oh, dude, really? My goddamn shots popped away that bomb. Cat's just taking forever, so I used my axe of a bunch. Yeah, the fact that you're going to put us layered behind him is so annoying. Just feels like cheating. An angel deal! Holy heck! Did you ever think we'd see the day and we only got Seraphim, but Seraphim's not terrible. Oh. What could the crawl space give us? Um, I don't really think any of this is speaking to us, is it? What happens if we drop down? 
Oh, it's an error room? Fuck. I didn't expect that. Okay. Um... Well, I guess we're leaving because I can't get that heart, whatever that thing is down there. Didn't realize dropping off would fall us into an error room. Anyways. Ah, oh, bollocks. <sighs> Anyways, there goes that challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. This was a struggle and a half. But if you'd like to see me play more of this challenge, more of your challenges in general, let me know. Yeah, see you guys in the next one.